yeah. Starting with flies in our mouths. Yeah. Welcome to my random weekend vlog. Alright. <laughs> oh my god, there's flies all over me. I just learning about I learned about Toronto midges today. It's like flies that are everywhere and we're down by the water. And we just got swarmed and now they're all over my body. Anyways, um, we're going to explore a little bit and go to dinner and yeah. I think have a couple drinks. This is like the first time we've ever like since we moved here actually like gone out and done something. Yeah. We're, oh, we're big time losers. Here's the Rogers Center and the CN Tower. Um, if you're wondering where my glasses are from, it's like this company called Fermu. I've got a discount code down below. They do like glasses, glasses, like prescription glasses too. Biggest fan. <laughs> you are my biggest fan. Huh? You are my biggest fan. Just enjoying some delightful food. I just saw someone from Newfoundland, which is so funny. Like you can't. I've seen so many people from Newfoundland since I've been here, and it's hilarious because we're in a city of like a few million people, and um, I keep seeing people from home. I'm like I moved away, so I wouldn't ever see people from home. So fun time. Good morning. You haven't been in the vlog yet. You're half the reason anybody watches my channel. Good morning guys, it is Saturday morning at like 9.30 and we just got up. We went to sleep at like 10 o'clock, we're really, really crazy. But I meant to mention last night because I was eating chicken wings and if you follow me on Snapchat, um, I've been meatless for like the past five days. So from like Monday to Friday, she doesn't like that. And yeah, so if you want to follow me on Snapchat, I kind of like vlog like this most days. Um, but yeah, it was just something new that I was trying for like diet purposes and being like more mindful and like I love animals. So it feels like wrong to eat them, but I love meat. So anyways, I went meatless for the whole week and it was pretty good. Um, but I'm definitely not going like vegetarian or vegan. I just want to be like a little bit more cognizant of what I'm eating and <laughs> stop. And, um, yeah, so I had chicken wings last night, though, and they were really good. Anyways, nothing crazy planned for today. I'm going to eat some breakfast. I just, like, cleaned the countertops and swept and stuff. Word of warning, if you're ever, like, moving into an apartment or buying a house, don't get black countertops because, like, when they're clean, they look great. Like, look, oh, yeah, beautiful. But, like, as soon as you get a crumb on it, like, that's the end of it. Like, they just look like crap. Um adulting these are the things that i'm learning and now complain about our countertops and i'm gonna do some filming and take some instagram pictures and stuff so i'll show you behind the scenes um of that kind of stuff and yeah <laughs> in bed I mean it's Saturday I worked like um, all last week basically from Monday to Sunday I was out of town for work um, and I'm a marketing coordinator so we've got some offices in the States and we were sponsoring an event so basically I had to be down there um, and just like being away from home now I just am like such a homebody this past um, week that I've been back so my boyfriend just went to work he's like a personal trainer exercise physiologist so sometimes he works on Saturdays was gonna film but now I'm catching up on Grey's Anatomy and it's funny because I'm like eating this thing that I made I'm like really bad at baking because I'm not good at following the rules so it was supposed to be like this um, like DIY peanut butter cup 
that you make with PB2, which is like that powdered peanut butter. Um, but I'm really bad, like I'm really good at cooking, but I'm bad at baking because I don't like following the rules. Um, and I've got some like new makeup that I'll show you guys and then I'll show you like my filming setup and stuff um, later. I generally film at night for some reason. Um, I don't know what it is, but I find the lighting is way hard to work with when you're working with natural light and like studio lights. I don't know, I haven't really figured it out totally. And I've also got to work on my media kit and this is kind of like, a one page sheet that has like all my channel statistics and like my demographics of the people that watch my channel and stuff and this is what I send to companies and I'm like hey would you like to send me products that I can talk about on my channel so that is something that I'm gonna work on today too because I recently hit 6,000 subscribers which is insane because I hit 5,000 like three weeks ago and um, so yeah I'm gonna work on that I kind of want to like make it look a little bit better than it currently does um, and yeah, I reach out to a few more brands because like the more brands that I get to work with, the better for you because then I'll get like more products and makes my life a little bit easier because it gets expensive sometimes having a YouTube channel because like you feel the pressure to buy all this new stuff and yeah, it gets pricey. So anyways, no real exciting updates. Hi, Bobush Cat. What are you doing? Say hi. Is that peanut butter for me? Yes. You're beautiful, girl. She almost like choked to death on a yellow gumdrop. It's like, what kind of a way to die for a cat is that? I was like, it's like a sugary treat. It's lemon flavored. Like she was like choking on something and I ran outside and it was a lemon gumdrop. I was like, you're the weirdest cat. Like she doesn't like meat that much, but she likes like ice cream and avocado and like I don't know I don't give it to her obviously but like if I leave like a bowl of like frozen yogurt she'll go lick it hi you're so tired you're so sleepy oh my god I'm so excited hi boobs what's new do you have something you needed to tell the people mm -hmm. I figured as much but um Canadian Netflix if you don't know is absolutely horrible and we don't have like all the same shows that American Netflix does so I downloaded this thing where it like pretends that I'm from the United States and you're totally not supposed to do that but anyways it was like blocking me from watching One Tree Hill for the past two months and I heard that Netflix was like cracking down on it which is BS like just because we're in Canada doesn't mean we don't want to watch like One Tree Hill and stuff um but anyways it just let me in I'm so excited I'm gonna make cauliflower pizza crust Trying to like strain out the cauliflower, I just microwaved it. And the paper towel was really, really hot, and then some of the cauliflower slipped through. I don't care. I'm still using it. Pinterest. <laughs> idiot and thought I was filming me putting the pizza together but I didn't um, but the pizza crust came out it's definitely not like super crispy but it's pretty good um, I'm gonna put it back in the oven now I've just got like um, some mushrooms onions tomato sauce or like diced tomatoes that I mix with like a little bit of barbecue sauce and sriracha uh, red onions um, some cheddar cheese and then this is like veggie hot dog cut up and then I put some Italian seasoning on there too so I'm gonna put it back in the oven for like five minutes, but I'm starving. Here it is, the final product. That was a ton of work, but I'm really excited that I finally got to try it. It's definitely like kind of soggy. I had to use like two spatulas to lift it up, but I bet it's gonna taste good. Having a bad makeup day. <laughs> Getting ready to film, and I like kind of baked under my eyes, and then when I wiped away the powder, it just like wiped away everything that was under my eyes. So I'm gonna need to redo that. So here is my filming setup. My lights are from Amazon. I'll link to them down in the description box. My tripod is from Walmart. Um, and then that's a Canon T5i. And then I just kind of sit on my bed. And my room is always really messy. And those deers are actually from Walmart. I got them at Christmas time. They were like 10 bucks each. Um, but yeah, I just film on my bed here. 
and I generally have like a little basket of like things that I want to talk about on my computer if I need to look up like any information. And now I've got to go grab Rue and uh, try and make her be cute in the background. So I just finished filming. I was filming my Makeup Geek uh, collection video. And my Lemon Drop shade was like already a mess and I tried to fix it. And then look. Yes, I filmed in sweatpants. Ugh. I got it all over myself and all over the bed. So I think I'm going to need to reorder it because I really, really love Lemon Drop. Um, but yeah, I think we're just going to cook some supper. I think we're going to make like calamari and nachos and make like bar food because that's what we're craving but we don't want to order in. <clears throat> so we're going to make it ourselves and watch a movie. Are you taking up enough space? Did you walk over everybody's head tonight? Just to sleep in between us because you're needy. Anyone else do this kind of thing in the morning? Watch cats vomiting to techno music? Just us. So I'm just getting ready to take some Instagram photos of some new products. So I thought I would show you a little sneak peek um, of a Canadian beauty video that I'm going to be doing. Or it may already be up. Um, that's just a photo. I'm just going to take a picture of that later. Anyways, um, but I got some new stuff. This is from the brand Nikki Garrett. And I really should have taken this out of the box before. Um, but they make uh, contour products. And it's a brand based out of here in Canada. I don't think they're made in Canada. But um, they are a Canadian brand and these are going to look real familiar to you because they so remind me of the sleek, um, oh my god I can't believe I'm doing this one handed. They remind me of the sleek contour kits so I'm going to be including these in a video and they make really really nice um, soft contour brushes as well. Then I've got a whole ton of stuff from Annabelle and Marcel. As mentioned, I'm in the middle of taking some Instagram photos and this is what goes into it. Um, I'm really trying to up my Instagram game. So I'm trying to like use my lighting and my good camera and have like cute accessories and stuff. But like I can barely store my makeup, let alone like a whole ton of accessories for Instagram. <laughs> but I'm working on it. So this is what my vanity looks like right now. So I think... While my boyfriend is at the gym still, I'm going to clean this up and then I think we're going to go out in a little bit. If you haven't noticed, I'm a little bit of a homebody this weekend. I really just don't feel like doing much and my neck is like really hurt, hurting me and it kind of goes like up into my head and gives me a bit of a headache. So I'm just trying to take it easy, but I do think we're going to go out and about a little bit um, shortly, but I'm just trying to get everything organized in my life, aka makeup mess. So time to organize so i'm getting there with the cleaning but how cute is this cookie that blink sent me i'm planning on doing like a waterproof makeup video and i just am not getting around to it i'm being super lazy about it but i wanted to use some of their new um waterproof products and they sent some along with a little personalized cookie i can't even believe it and i forgot that i had it so i'm totally gonna eat this tonight <laughs> Oh, oh my wow. god. That's the longest one I've ever heard. Oh, it's a little magic. Yeah. Wow. Hi guys. You've barely been in my vlog, Bubs. Yeah. People are gonna think you're Big like come back. Let's go. <laughs> People are gonna think you're like my broody silent boyfriend. Yeah. Or that you didn't exist in the I first place. I don't talk much, but when I do, you have to listen. <laughs> That's what it is. Yeah. That's what it is. Okay. Have to listen because. <laughs> Never mind. Why? I was gonna make a foreigner joke. <laughs> Jk. So we the just... good thing about you is always like you're so funny, you know. That, that's what I like <laughs> about you, you know. I'm hilarious. Full of jokes all the time. That's good. Um, so we just got to the Hyde Park area, and we've never been here before, and it's weird because I feel super quiet, and there's like birds everywhere. 
but it's really nice but because we're in like the downtown area like super super downtown yeah. I guess it's like really really loud but you don't really realize but now that I'm hearing like birds chirping and stuff I'm kind of like oh yeah right nature mm -hmm. so we're gonna find this Serbian store and kind of wander around a little bit it's like a pretty nice day also if you'd like us to do the boyfriend tag let me know down below What's the boyfriend tag? it's just questions don't worry you don't have to do my makeup I don't have to do your makeup yeah. Don't panic. He's gonna be like, should I dump my boyfriend? <laughs> kind of contest or leave your comments below, should guys. I, should I dump my boyfriend? Like this video. Yeah. And Imagine. Share. I bet somebody did people do that. Yeah. Idiots. Yeah, what is it called? Uh bananitsa. Yeah. It's like a banana flavored chocolate. Okay, cool. And it seems like a banana shape yeah too. cute so it's very yeah. we're here at the serbian store or eastern european right yeah gonna get some pumpkin seeds some other serbian stuff maybe we'll do like a video tasting all this yeah so we are just home from our little adventure to the serbian store and we bought a whole bunch of stuff so I'm gonna try this thing here now. It's called what? Uh, Bananitsa. 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 Chocolate and bananitsa. Can you open it for me? I can. So, what, is this something that you used to eat a lot when you were a kid? Yeah, I used to love this. And I know I have a few subscribers from Serbia, so let me know down below um, what we should try next time we go to the Serbian store. I think we're gonna do a video too, maybe, of trying Serbian snacks. Um, because serving food is like pretty, um, it's not like super spicy or like super crazy or anything. Let me see the whole thing. It's like a banana It's like a shape. little banana. Oh, it's soft. Yeah. It tastes like, um, these like marshmallow banana candies. You can get like strawberry ones too. It tastes like those, but not as intense. And then the chocolate on the outside, like, you know, at Christmas and Easter, you can get like chocolate covered, like like marshmallow eggs it's kind of what it tastes like it's like a hybrid of those two it's pretty good yeah it sauce awesome. smells pretty good come on let's be realistic here it's pretty good yeah anyways on that note i'm gonna end the vlog let me know if you'd like to see more like weekend vlogs or just like if we end up going to like kensington market or any like cool places around toronto i can totally vlog i also do this like pretty often just on my snapchat like casual kind of what i'm up to vlogging and like beauty mail unboxings and that kind of stuff so i'll leave my link to snapchat down below and i'm gonna see you guys next time bye bye bye